To access The Economist, start on the online library page in StudyNet, click on the A to Z list of journals. In the search box that comes up, type in the, the Economist, click search, and then click through to the full text available in Gale Academic One file. We're now within the Gale Academic One file at the home page for The Economist. And here you get a bit more information about The Economist itself and its coverage. And it tells you that the full text available is from 1988 to the current issue. If you know of a sp specific article that you're interested in and you know the date and the issue it was published in, you can drill down to it via the year and the date. So I'm interested in an article that appeared in the March the 10th issue and it was called Zai v Marshall Free Exchange. And there it is. I can just open that up and I've got the full text there. You've got some options to generate a citation, to email it, to download it, print it or create a permanent link to it and create highlights and notes. So some really useful features there. I'm going to go back to the home page. Now you might not always have a specific article in mind and you might need to do a general search. And the search within publication box at the top right of the screen is where to go. So you see I've already set up a search on US foreign policy. So if I simply submit that, it brings up a results list of nearly five and a half thousand articles. These are displayed in order of relevance, but I can change that to date order should I wish. Five and a half thousand is maybe too many to look through, so you might want to search within these articles for something more specific. So if I'm interested in US foreign policy and the Middle East, I can just type in Middle East to search for within the articles I've already retrieved. And I've narrowed that down to 715. There are other filters you can use. Publication date, for example, can be very useful. So if you're interested in articles from say the last 10 years from the end of August 2010 to the present day end of August 2020 we can apply that limit and we've now got a list of 226 articles so quite easy to narrow down and focus your search